affiliate marketing and how to get started in 2022. I'm Josh. I'm a normal guy who enjoys his passive income and time freedom. And I want you to as well. Go ahead and subscribe, follow, share, all those things. Click the bell icon because I'm going to be giving you a step-by-step -step process of how to get your online business going right away because I'm going to be sharing with you a little bit about this huge opportunity that's only been around for about a year and people are making major, major money with it within one year of promoting it. So stick around to the end. How to get started for beginners. This is a three-step system to quit your job and have time and financial freedom. The exact formula that I'm about to share with you is how thousands and thousands of people just this past year have gotten out of their jobs and have made more money than a job could ever even make them. So what is affiliate marketing? Okay, well, you're going to promote a business's or a program's product. You'll join that business's program, their affiliate program, but you promote another business's products and earn commissions. It's that simple. Have you ever told one of your friends about a product and they went and bought it, but you didn't get a commission off of that? That's what this is. You're just going to make money off of your referrals. It's basic. It's so simple, it almost drives people crazy. So why affiliate marketing? Well, you don't have to create any products. You don't have to have a service to provide. It's so easy. Um, the products are already out there. You just have to find them and then promote them. There's no inventory. So there's no room in your house that's got boxes stacked high with like yoga pants that you've had to buy for thousands of dollars and hope that you sell. There's no inventory. They carry the inventory. You just promote it. Uh, there's no customer service, no customer support, so you don't have to even be talking to anybody. If you're like a recluse, after, especially after this pandemic, and you just want to be left alone, affiliate marketing is the perfect business for you. There's no employees to manage. You don't have to deal with any of that. And there's no dealing with refunds or chargebacks. And there's a low startup cost, if not zero startup costs. And I, I'm going to be doing some videos on that. So go ahead and follow, like, and subscribe, all those things, because this is going to be a series that I'm going to be teaching you step by step how to do this okay here are the three big steps in affiliate marketing one picking your niche or your product the product would be this t-shirt the niche would be clothes right the product could be this microphone but the niche would be recording equipment you want to find your product in your niche and once that product or niche in that affiliate business starts taking off you can start another one you could do it a whole another one on something completely different the second step is building your funnels and in your emails to collect emails yes uh josh aren't emails so 2009 no they're not and i'll show you why and then we're going to promote them we're going to be getting traffic and then earning commissions how simple does this sound it's as easy as it sounds at least when the when the business is all built okay here's some examples of products to promote physical products, right? Amazon, Walmart, 95%, if not all big businesses have affiliate programs. Right now you can Google um, Best Buy affiliate program. I guarantee they've got an affiliate program. You can go, um, I don't know, just go have some fun searching for, for physical products and companies that have affiliate programs. And then you could promote eBooks, okay? You could promote, you could be a Kindle affiliate. Um, you could do digital products. Digital products are great because there's no overhead. People didn't pay a bunch of money to make a physical product. This is the difference between digital and physical. Physical products, this shirt might have cost them $6 to make, so they need to sell it for $12 to make a profit. And you're going to be getting 5 to 10% of that commission, right? Um, but digital products, they can be 100 to ten thousand dollars but there's no overhead so they can give you 40 to 50 percent commissions and they don't care it's not like they're missing out on anything there's no overhead cost for them uh, apps okay you could you could promote apps just google app affiliate programs travel services these are big um, expedia all these big companies have affiliate programs one of my students is promoting a yoga retreat center program so she joined that program that affiliate program and some of these trips are ten thousand dollars and they're forty percent commissions don't tell me people are not able to leave their jobs through affiliate marketing try it try it all right Subscription services. Let's use ClickFunnels, for example. Uh, if you're going to be in the affiliate marketing niche, you're going to know what ClickFunnels is. But if ClickFunnels is $100 a month for everybody, right? And they're giving 40% commissions every single month. 
So if you join the ClickFunnels affiliate program and you get your own link and you send that link to somebody and someone clicks on your link and buys affiliate uh, buys uh, ClickFunnels, you're going to be getting $40 a month from each person every single month. Okay, You only need 100 of those to be making $4,000 per month passively. You can't tell me that people aren't leaving their jobs for affiliate marketing. Okay, And it only gets better. Online courses. This is this is the big one. I promote online courses because online courses are a lot like digital products because most of them are digital products unless they add some kind of like one-on-one -on -one coaching. Online courses can be from $2,500 to $10,000 and they're giving uh, 40 to 50% commissions. Guys, you can't tell me that people aren't able to quit their jobs for affiliate marketing. I mean, that's that's a $3,000 commission sometimes. You only really need two of those to live a really great life uh, compared to a, a lot of people here in America, all right? So let's keep going. Here are the big three. These are the big three niches or niches or niches, whatever you want to call it. I don't care that you want to be in to make a lot of money, okay? Because everyone's going to care about their health, wealth, and relationships. Those are the three main ones that people pay big money for, and it's recession-proof, guys. In a recession, wouldn't people want to be out there learning how to stay healthy? Is Are people still wanting to do that? Yes. Uh, in a recession or a pandemic, aren't people still wanting to uh, to become wealthy? Yes. Relationships. I mean, come on. During a pandemic, when, when married couples are stuck at home, aren't they going to want some kind of like online counseling? <laughs> Give me a break. All right. So health. You don't want to make it just like, I'm in the health niche. You want to niche down, which means trim down your audience in a sense, right? So health would be, hey, I could be in health. Okay, I could be in weight loss, or I could even be in yoga weight loss or keto. Wealth is the niche that I'm in. This is the most profitable niche out of all niches. You can look it up. I'm in the wealth niche, but I'm not just in the wealth niche. I'm also in the make money online niche. I'm not just in the make money online niche. I'm in the affiliate marketing high ticket make money online niche. Okay, so I'm trying to help other people make high ticket sales online. Okay, then there's the relationships, dating, divorce, single men. I mean, there's just so many, so many things out there that you can, uh, that you can choose from. So let's go into, uh, let's go into more, uh, well, I think that I want to throw this up here. Boom. You could go with hobbies, electronics, camera gear, lenses, photography. You could do an outdoors niche selling hiking gear, climbing gear. One of my students is going to be doing uh, climbing gear because he's a massive ice climber and does awesome stuff. And so he's going to sell that gear. You know, a lot of that gear is worth thousands of dollars. So if he's going to be getting 10% commissions on that, you can imagine that one person will come in and buy an enormous amount of stuff for their first outdoor hiking time. And he's going to be just making tons of money off that one person. Fashion, hobbies, somebody else is doing uh, woodworking. I got two people doing travel. Um, a couple other people doing gaming. I have a student who, uh, he just, he just like, he just paid for one session, which I don't do anymore. Uh, it's really not worth my time. And if you're coaching in the future, it's not worth your time unless they pay big, big dollars for that one. Cause you're trying to pile in all this information into one, one session. I mean, it's, it's a lot of work, but he started uh, the next day he started going and doing, um, keyboards for gaming. He made $80 his first day promoting keyboards keyboards for gaming. I mean, come on, people. You can't tell me people aren't leaving their jobs uh, for affiliate marketing. Okay, step one, what's your offer? What is your product? What do you love? What could you talk about forever? Because you're going to be talking about this a lot, right? Is it something that you could teach? Again, if this is something that you could teach, you might want to start even looking into the coaching space, which I'll also be showing you here uh, on this channel. So go ahead and subscribe so we can get those in the future. And then you want to ask yourself, what is what are people going to pay high ticket for that I can get high commissions for? And I've got two options for you. If you want to be in the make money space, um, which is the most profitable space. If you want to go that route, um, go ahead and pick one of the two that I'm going to show you. This one huge opportunity that's like basically brand new. Um, so keep, stay, stay to the end. Stay with me. Stay with me. All right. So you want to focus on your products. What is your main core product, right? What's your big product? Okay. You also want to be thinking, is it high ticket enough? Is it high quality? 
is it convertible, right? Is the you are you are in the promotion business, okay? You are not selling the product. You are promoting it, okay? It's their job to sell the product. So if you're promoting something to a website that sucks and they're not getting conversions, you want this website to be convertible. Uh, both the programs that I promote are extremely convertible. They hook them, they get them, and they make the sale, okay? Uh, does the program you're promoting have a value ladder? A value ladder is basically this. You're giving away a free video or a free guide, and then they say, and, and then they get your email address, and they go in and say, hey, don't leave yet. Here's a $50 product that's even better. And then, oh, don't leave yet. There's a $1,000 product. Those are great. Value ladders are an, an incredible incredibly powerful system. Do they follow up, right? Do they have a hard-coded affiliate program? Now, affiliate programs will have cookies. I don't know if you've ever heard of cookies before, but it's the ability for them to track how long of a time has it been since they have been connected to your link. So a lot of these affiliate programs will say 30-day cookies, right? I think Amazon's got 30-day cookies. So if they click your link and go to Amazon and then they don't buy anything, if they come back 29 days later without your link, Amazon will remember that you sent them there and you'll still get the commissions. A hard-coded affiliate program is if you've sent somebody to that product, you are the affiliate like referral forever. And that's with one of the programs that I promote, which I really highly recommend if you want to get into making money online and you really want to leave your job and not make this a hobby, but make this like a career and a true business. These are the two you're going to want to be looking into. And look, they're right here. Legendary. You can find that in the in the uh, links in the description, or you can go to realjoshsabo.com and check that out. And then another one here, uh, which is the which is the uh, bonus that I'm going to be sharing more with you. But the links are also going to be in the bio. Okay, so how do people fail with affiliate marketing? One, it's so simple. How do people fail with anything? They quit, right? If, if you if you fail and keep going, you don't really fail. You've learned something. What do they say? You don't. If uh, I either win or I learn, right? There's no lose. There's no there's no failure. Uh, real businesses take time, consistency, and understanding. And I'm hoping that I can provide some understanding for you so that you can get started. And the other part, the other reason people fail is that they take those links that the businesses give them and they just send those links out there. So the person clicks on the link and they go to the business and they buy, but you have no way of tracking that and you have no way to sell something else to like you've just lost a client. Um, this has to do with the emails. I always tell all my uh, all my uh, my sales consultants that I that I work with. I say, hey, don't just give your card out. Collect their business card because they're not going to call you. It's just not going to happen. Well, maybe it will. So here's the system for collecting emails. Two. This is the build your system. This is where the funnel and the emails come in. You want to build your system. So this is traffic, which will be going over in step three. Traffic. You're going to be making TikTok videos, YouTube videos, Instagram posts, Pinterest, Facebook. But here is the funnel. This is the system right here. These two right there. Okay. So let's say I have a freebie I want to give away. In order to collect an email, you should usually have something that they'll put an email in for. I wouldn't ever say, join my newsletter. I've done that before, and i got like 26 people in my email in a year. That doesn't work. That was before I really started going after this thing. So you're going to want, hey, join my freebie. Clicks the link, goes to the opt-in page. Put in your email, and I will send you this free video. They click, they put that in, they click opt in, and then you've collected an email. Okay, that's a big deal. Second step is your bridge page or thank you page. This is called a landing page because that's where people land, or an opt in page because that's where people opt in to get what you're what you're offering. This is the bridge page or thank you page. Okay. This has could have a little video of you. Congratulations. You're on your next, you're on this big next step. And if you go to realjoshsabo.com, you can just copy my bridge, like my bridge page. You can just copy my my video. Just write it down uh, and then use it as a script. It's so easy. Again, I'm just giving that to you. And then that sends them to a sales page. This is the business's website that you got the link for. That sends them here. Okay. The great thing about emails is that you can have next uh, first day, send them to there. Second day, send them back. What do they say? It usually takes like seven to ten touches before somebody buys something. Can you see how people are quitting their jobs for affiliate marketing? 
Yeah, me too. Okay. All right, next big step here. This is what a funnel looks like. Again, go to realjoshsabo.com. You can see a funnel there um, or manycommissions.com to see a funnel there. But uh, in order to get, again, to, in order to get an email, you want to have a freebie, a free gift, a free guide, a free video, a discount code, and then you can start collecting emails. Okay, so here's my free guide. I'll have that in the uh, in the bio or in the description as well so that you can just copy it or you can just read through it. Um, then it's going to go to the opt-in page where you're collecting an email. And then it's going to go to the product page. That's the uh, online course that I promote and that I would recommend you promote as well because they're making millionaires out of their program. Okay. So that's the that's the idea of what a funnel looks like. Hopefully you're you're following along. If not, guess what? This is a video. You can just watch it again. So why emails? Why use this thing that everybody thought was dead? It's not dead. Most of the time you need an email address to get into any social media platform anyways. People have emails. They just need to be reminded to look at them. So why emails? Emails can't be taken away from you. TikTok was almost taken away from us, folks. It was 2020. Uh, TikTok was almost taken away. Um, Facebook's stock is down, right? Like with this meta stuff. I think that it's going to do well, but I mean, maybe. Don't, don't quote me on that. But at the same time, these platforms can be taken away, but emails can never be taken away from you. So let's say this email service goes out of business. They are legally obligated to give you those emails, right? You've earned them. They're yours. So you can just hop on over with those emails and continue your business as usual. You can send multiple offers to the products. Let's look back at, uh, let's look back at this. This email can go to that. This email can go to your YouTube channel. Hey, did you see this video that I did? Blah, 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 blah. This one could go sent, be sent to a whole nother product, right? If you're in a niche, the health niche, that one could go to keto. That one could go to yoga. But you can start sending people to many, many different things. Um, where are we here? Boom. Uh, sending people to other platforms. You could set up webinars if you are someone who wants them to teach something, right? Like I have a student who's into SEO, search engine optimization. He wants to start coaching. If he has 2,000 people in this in this uh, email list and he only gets like 5% to come to a $1,000 webinar that he has, that's a lot of money in one day. Come on, people. Are you seeing how people are leaving their jobs for affiliate marketing? Come on. All right. And then you have them check their emails on the... Uh, on the bridge page, hey, this uh, free guide has been sent to your email. You're going to want to check it regularly, this little video. Hey, you're going to want to uh, check your spam folder because these emails are going to be coming to you regularly. Now you've helped them understand where their content and value is going to be coming from. So the power of an email list, it's automated. Uh, you're going to look, you're going to find that Aweber has a, it's an auto response. So you're going to have all these emails written up ahead of time. 15 to 30 of these things, maybe even thousands. It doesn't matter. But these are going to be automated in these in these like Aweber or GetResponse and ClickFunnels. Well, ClickFunnels, but Aweber and GetResponse, Builder, all these things will send out emails automatically. So when someone subscribes, it automatically sends them an email. Then you put in wait a day, and the next day they get email too. Then you put in wait a day, and, uh, and maybe I'll do that in another video in the future. So you need to subscribe and click the bell icon for the next video that's going to be coming out. Okay, so here's the list. This is how you build an email list. Boom, 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 boom. All right, what can I use for my funnel? All right, you can use ClickFunnels. It is um, expensive for the newbie who doesn't want to spend a ton of money on this, but that is one of the best. You can do Aweber. It's free up to 500 subscribers, but once you have 500 subscribers, you should be making a good enough amount of money to pay for it. Uh, GetResponse, I use both of these. Builderall is good, I hear. I haven't had a whole lot of experience with it, and ConvertKit is is decent for beginners, but there's just not a, a ton of, uh, a, you can't really customize it very well. So again, let's look at the build the system. Traffic comes from these, and you're going to have links in your bios and your descriptions that's going to send them to the opt-in, the opt-in to the bridge, the bridge to the sales, and the sales to the commissions. Email to the sales, email to there, email to there. It's just this beautiful web of sales. Now, step three traffic okay that's this section right here traffic traffic can come from tiktok instagram youtube pinterest um 
I can actually put a link to, uh, it's called 15 second free leads in the description. So you can start making, you can start getting leads uh, and learn how to do that on TikTok. Um, but I send all my students to TikTok first. Uh, it's just more fun. It's less discouraging. YouTube takes a lot longer to build that, uh, build that following unless you do it the way that I teach it. <laughs> um, free traffic builds your brand. In the end, you become the brand right? You become the brand. People come to you to trust you. I wouldn't call it an, an influencer. Your goal isn't to have millions and millions. I mean, that could be one of your goals, but the goal isn't just to have all these millions of people and then you get sponsored by a swimsuit company. The goal, you could be making hundreds of thousands of dollars and only have like 50 people subscribe to you on YouTube with affiliate marketing. Are you seeing what I'm saying? Because if they click on that link and you get a $3,200 commission off that link, you don't need subscribers. You just need people to watch these videos once. Okay. And then uh, like, for instance, on YouTube, your content lives forever. I had a YouTube channel. I was promoting mini trampolines. I actually had a stroke in my early 20s. Um, you wouldn't be, uh, you wouldn't believe it by looking at me, but uh, I had a stroke. Um, and uh, so I just decided to, uh, I found out that mini trampolines are like, they're just the best way to, to work out for the human body. And it was something that I could do. And I'm basically fully recovered. And so I promote that, but it's only like $100 commissions. doesn't matter. I put up 14 videos on this YouTube channel and I'm still making money today. It was making $150 average every single month and I had 14 videos on there, guys, 14 videos. And three years later, I'm still making money. I still check that PayPal account. I was like, oh, there's a couple couple thousand dollars in there. That's crazy, all right? Because people are still watching those videos. TikTok's a little bit different. They still pop up every now and then, but, but on YouTube, people are searching for that content. So if you have it set up the right way, then people will search for it. Okay, there's no financial stress because it's free, all right? It is slower typically. Um, with paid traffic, you get you get more leads more, a lot faster. It does take time, and yeah, the algorithm changes. Okay, paid traffic. Paid traffic is Facebook ads, Google ads, YouTube ads. You get quicker results. They're laser targeted leads, and it's measurable because you can measure how many people have clicked and how many people have done this and how you can change things, and you have complete, complete control. Yes, it does cost money. If you have a small budget, it might be a little tough to get that going, and yeah, it is a little stressful sometimes because you're working with technology, and technology can freak out, but I want to go into your homework. What are you planning on promoting? What is something that like when I was talking about the uh, about the products and niches, what was the one thing, the, the one thing that you were like, I could promote this? Write it in the comments, guys. Uh, you're not going to be giving away your secrets. Again, there's no competition. Uh, competition online is like me having an ice cream shop in Michigan and having somebody else has an ice cream shop in Hawaii. Guys, there's billions of people online. Stop thinking that things are oversaturated. So what are you thinking about promoting? What's one of the big three uh, niches that you were thinking about? All right, what was your biggest takeaway from this video? And next, do some research on TikTok. Research who might be doing and promoting a similar product on TikTok that you are thinking about promoting. And then just model all their stuff. Find out in their bio what they're promoting. Find out if they're collecting emails because if they're not, you could be making more money than them. Uh, these are all the things that you need to start thinking about. So go ahead and do this homework. And now for the bonus. Okay, <clears throat> so this does seem like a lot of work because it is. It is a lot of work to set this up. But just like an investment, it takes time. You put the hard work in and now you're making money. Um, I just made a video just like taking down my Christmas decorations. It's so much easier to take things down. It's so much harder to put things up, but I've enjoyed it all, all winter long. Um, so this, this bonus product that I'm going to I'm going to program that I'm going to, I'm going to show you. It's in the link in my bio. Um, I made $600 my first two days promoting this new product and it's only been a year. It's only been available for a year and, uh, yeah, well, look, yeah, it's only a year old. You don't have to build the funnel. It's not the work. Um, you don't have to build the funnel. Um, you basically just start promoting it and make money. Um, people are making seven figures doing this within their first year because it's only been a year. I know these people. Um, and so it's, and it's, it's all done for you. It's, it's all there. So if that's what you want to promote, remember that it's in the wealth niche, this new pro, this new service or this new uh, program is in the wealth niche. It is in the affiliate marketing niche as well. Very, very, very high ticket. And uh, it's making people a lot, a lot, a lot of money. So they've already done the hard work for you, the niche, the funnel, the traffic and more. If you want to be in the make money online, uh, honestly, you're going to be spending less way less on this than you'd spend for my program, unless you want me to help you go through it one-on-one. -on -one. Um, but you're going to be spending less on this and it's already all done for you. They offer recurring 
so that would be like the subscription service. They offer medium tickets, so that's the value ladder. They've got like levels of payments and then a high ticket commission, which could be up to around $3,200 for you. And guys, it's super basic. Super opportunity to be making like potentially $3,200 commissions is get commissions today. So it's in the link in the bio or a link in the description. Click on get commissions today and get going. Just do it. Uh, when you go through the process, just go ahead and go through every stream of income because there's multiple streams of income possibilities and potential for you. Uh, but reach back out to me when you've signed up and then I'm going to go ahead and do a training on YouTube about that. So we'll see you soon. Subscribe, comment, share. We'll see you all around.